Hey guys, it's super windy out here, so bear with me, but we have the 3791RD Montana fifth wheel to show you guys. It's gorgeous. I thought they did a really great job and there's a ton of features to show you guys. We're gonna take a look at the outside first before heading inside. So you have your power awning here at the um, camper side. So you have additional shading if you need it. You have some outdoor speakers so you can always listen to your um, tunes and stuff. Frameless windows all across, which are super sleek looking. Your pass-through storage is right here. And then next to that, you have your propane tank on both sides. You have some storage here at the very front. And then you have your battery box right next to that. And on this side, we have our auto leveling system, which is great. And then your propane that I was telling you guys about. And then massive pass-through storage. You got loads of room for all of your camping goods. And I wanted to show this to you guys, but your exterior showers over here, winterizing system, which is great. Um, you also have your black and gray tank over here. So this is where you would access all of that. And then here at the end, I went ahead and opened these up for you guys so you can see how much storage is underneath this thing. And then at the very end, we have this huge drawer. So if you have really heavy camping goods, you can pull that out, make it a lot easier to get in and out. We also have our ladder. So we are rooftop accessible. We have our um, prepped for a rear view camera. So you can see what you're doing while you're hauling this thing down the road. You have your solid steps, which you guys know that we love so much. Plus, you have your helping handle for really clumsy people like me. Now, let's go take a look. We're going to start at the very front of the camper today. So, this is our master suite, and it is sweet. So, you have your king-size bed, storage underneath that, nightstands on either side. You also have outlets plus phone charging ports on both sides. And as you can see, it's a little dark in here, but we have block out night curtains that are all across the camper. You have a quiet AC system in here. So you're still staying cool up here, but you don't have to hear the AC. Across from your bed, you have your dresser. So you got additional countertop space if you need it, plus six sets of drawers. Then of course you got your TV right above. And then this closet to the left of that. This is where your two extra dining room ch dining room chair tables are, which I'll show you in a second. But this is also where you're prepped for your washer and dryer unit. And then I went ahead and opened this up for you guys um, so I can show you this laundry hamper that is included with your closet. You also have countertop space plus some shoe storage cubbies. And they also have these gorgeous sliding mirror panel doors. Across from that, you do have a barn style sliding door to have some privacy, but these style doors are really popular right now, so I think it's really gorgeous and pretty. Love that they included it. Even with the bathroom, they have that barn style sliding door. So you have your toilet to the left of the entrance, and then across you have your sit down shower, perfect for relaxing. You even have a skylight. So you got natural light in here. Then your sink is to the right of the entrance. You got storage below it. And then your stainless steel sink and it kind of swoops down a little bit. So if you need to fill it with water, you don't have to worry about it spilling over. You have some storage right next to that. And then of course your mirror. Coming down the steps, we have this coat hanger hook. Um, so you can hang your coats there, maybe your dog leashes hang up your keys, all that type of stuff. And then this is our kitchen area. To the right of the steps, we have our coffee bar. So you can use this for your, your coffee maker, your air fryer, or whatever electronic kitchen goods. Storage below it as well as above. And I love that they included textured diamond styled um, pattern on all of the cabinets here in the kitchen. To the left we have pantry storage. So you got a lot of room for your cleaning supplies 
or your dried canned goods. And then I have to stand back really far for this because you have a residential size fridge in this camper. So it is stainless steel and I love that it's residential. It's bigger than my fridge at home. Oh, it's locked right now, but it is bigger than my fridge at home. Tons of room for all of your stuff. You have your island right across. You have a 70-30 split stainless steel sink with a pull-down nozzle. Then you got storage below it. To the left is actually hidden trash compartment, so you don't have to smell it. Across from your island, you have your stove and oven. So you have storage on either side. Counter space for extra food prepping space. Your stove actually has three burners on this coach. Plus, it has a glass range cover to protect it from spillage. Or if you want to use this to have additional food prepping space, which is really nice. You have outlets that kind of hide like this. So this is one that's showing, but it does hide if you need to. Um, does have phone charging and outlet ports on both sides. And then let me show you the oven. Just above that, you have your residential size microwave. And that's stainless steel as well. Cabinets on either side. Plus, you have a wine rack, which is always a plus. So across from that, you have your freestanding dining room table. And the table does extend out if you have a big family or if your friends are coming over to hang out. You would just have to grab those two extra chairs that are in your closet. Um, but you have the extra space if you need it. You have windows all across, so you always have a view while you're eating. And then coming up these steps is our entertainment area. So as you can see, we have three sets of sitting space. We have our theater reclining seats right next to our steps. And they do emit heat. They have massages built into them. Plus, they have um, USB phone charging ports, which is the perfect napping space in the camper, if you ask me. Built-in cup holders plus remote storage. Then you have your sleeper sofas on either side. So you got additional sleeping space if you need it. Lots of windows all across. So you always have a view here as well. And then just across from your theater reclining seats, you have your entertainment system. Really big fireplace here at the bottom. And what's really cool about this is the flames actually change colors, which is great. Plus, you can use the fireplace without having to emit heat, so it just adds an extra homey feel. Plus, it doesn't use up all of your propane tank gas. So, literally, it's a win-win, win, win-win-win. Win. <laughs> so, you have storage on either side, maybe for some board games, DVD, um, DVDs, all that type of stuff. Just above your fireplace, you have your Bluetooth speaker system. So, this is where you would access your outdoor speakers as well as your indoor. Then you have your massive TV, and it does slide down, so if you need to use this additional um, mantle space, you can do that. Um, but as you can see, they showed it to you guys, and it has that wooden feature that looks like the man mantle space. Plus, you have cabinets on either side. And you have your AC system here as well, so you don't have to hear it while you're up here and you're staying cool throughout your camper. So this is the Montana. Let us know what you guys think.